great story. So, Angela, are you uh, do you play do puzzles at home? You know, we don't have any puzzles. We uh, we play euchre, we play Scrabble. So we might have to break those games out as mm. we uh, head into the first full weekend of the stay at home order. Uh, and it's going to be a stormy weekend, especially the early half. What an interesting day in terms of temperature today. 78 degrees in Bedford, almost 30 colder than that in Kokomo. 49. We're kind of in the middle at 58 in Indianapolis and in the middle or what's separating the cooler air from the warmer air is a boundary and that boundary is a warm front. Eventually that boundary lifts north and we all get into the 70s tomorrow. In fact, temperatures will start to climb overnight, but that boundary will also be the trigger for some scattered showers and thunderstorms, a few of which tonight and early tomorrow may produce some hail or some damaging winds. We want you to stay weather aware the next wave of storms arriving around 9 o'clock. When you join us at 11, we'll be tracking the storms with live Doppler 13 radar with some heavy rain, potential for some lightning, hail, and again, some damaging winds. Might have a couple of hail-producing thunderstorms very early tomorrow morning as well. This is 3 a.m. on Saturday. Now, eventually, that boundary lifts north, and so will the focus for the heaviest rain. That's 7 o'clock tomorrow. Tomorrow, we're going to be on the lookout for some strong to severe storms, not only early in the morning, but what's going to come later in the day. And the Storm Prediction Center really eyeing northwest Illinois for the potential for severe storms that may include tornadoes. We'll be watching this, obviously, very carefully as whatever does develop in Illinois will be moving our way. Should be in a weakening state, but it's something we'll keep a close eye on for you. Scattered showers and thunderstorms at least through about the noon hour. Then we get some dry, windy, warm hours ahead of that bigger line of perhaps tornado producing storms that will develop across Illinois. That six o'clock tomorrow evening, the storms locally should start to clear the state by late Saturday night and early Sunday. We'll be on the cooler side of this weather system for the end of the weekend. Rain and storms, we encourage you to stay weather aware over the next 24 to 36 hours. Breezy and cooler, 58 for your Sunday. Dry on Monday with another chance for a few showers on Tuesday next week. Angela, still ahead for you, a local school doing this.